The entertainment world lost a jack of all trades last week. Ricky Jay was an oddball showman with an encyclopedic knowledge of his craft, an unmatched skill in using his hands to fool the eyes. It took him from a sideshow act to the bright lights of Hollywood. Would you be so kind as, uh, as to mention it for me? Jack of Diamonds. Jack of Diamonds out of the deck into my hand as if propelled. Uh. In the hands of Ricky Jay, a deck of cards could come to life. You're nine of clubs, you're six of diamonds. <laughs> Jay, who died last week, was known as a magician's magician, whose tricks baffled Fade. even the most experienced sleight of hand artists. If you're attacked by a band of animals or an animal band, fire and keep dancing. Dance, you devils, dance. Long a fixture on late night television, Jay began performing in front of audiences as a boy. But his obsession with magic ran far deeper. Jay was known as a foremost expert on the subject, writing several books on magic, sideshow entertainers, con men, and hustlers throughout the ages. Club Flush. You owe me $6,000. That knowledge landed him work as a technical consultant in Hollywood. His company built the wheelchair used in Forrest Gump that hid actor Gary Sinise's legs. He also found his way into movies and television shows. Even law enforcement was interested in his ability to spot a cheat, as he told 60 Minutes in 2010, while getting one over on Morley Safer. I would also be aware of someone who will rely heavily on an affiliation with an investor group, be it religious, ethnic, or geographic. He was describing Madoff to a T. I think these elements will make the market ripe for any sort of pyramid or Ponzi scam, Ricky Jack. And that is pure Bernard Madoff. It's pure Bernie Madoff. But can I tell you another element of the con? That I actually made this page on Photoshop last night <laughs> and put it into this bullet. But his ability to defy reality with a shift of the hands and a shuffle of the deck is what made Ricky Jay an ace entertainer. Wow, you know, just an extraordinary guy, an extraordinary, an amazing magician, too, and, and who became a movie star, in effect. There's, there's something about magic that just brings us all in. Yeah. It really does. We all love to be tricked. <laughs> well. Love to be fooled.